All right, hey guys. So I recorded this video, and it was going well. And then I go to show recordings. I click on the video. I start watching it, and then I realize my microphone <sighs> in OBS. It didn't register my microphone because my microphone wasn't plugged in, even though it was plugged in. So now I have to redo the whole video all fucking over again. This 26% save file? Guess what? Guess what? Guess what I get to do? I get to delete it, and I get to start all over. <sighs> Once a baton- Whoa! I need to enunciate my words and slow down. Once upon a time, in a magical place called Inkwell Isle, there were two brothers named Cuphead and Mugman. They lived without a care under the watchful eye of the wise Elder Kettle. One day, the two boys wandered far from home and, despite the Elder Kettle's many warnings, ended up on the wrong side of the tracks and entered the Devil's Casino. Inside, Cuphead and Mugman soon found themselves on a winning streak at the craps table. A dog! Explained King Dice, the casino's sleazy manager. These fellas can't lose! Nice run, boys, laughed a newcomer. The brothers gasped. Gasped. It was the casino's owner, the devil himself. Now, how about we raise the stakes, he suggested with a toothy grin. When one more roll and all the loot in my, in my casino is yours, the devil boomed. But if you lose, I'll have your souls, deal? Cuphead, blinded by easy riches, nodded and grabbed the dice for a throw. Good gosh, Cuphead, no, cried Mugman, for he understood the danger, but it was too late. Snake eyes, laughed the devil while slamming the floor. You lose! The brothers trembled in fear as he loomed over them. Now about those souls. The brothers pleaded for their very lives. Th there must be another way to repay you, Mag Mugman st stammered. Yes, please, mister, Cuphead added. Hmm, perhaps there is, the devil snickered, pulling out a parchment. I have here a list of my runaway debtors. Collect their souls for me and I just might pardon you two mugs. Now get going, the devil roared, kicking the boys out most rudely. You have not you have till mid midnight tomorrow to collect every one of those souls. Otherwise, I'll be the one collecting yours. Cuphead and Mugman were terribly frightened and ran away as fast as they could. Come on, Mug, panted Cuphead. We have to find Elder, Elder Kettle. He'll know what to do. What a fine pickle you boys have gotten yourselves into. I know you don't want to be pawns of the devil, but if you refuse, I can't bear to imagine your fate. You must play along for now. Collect those contracts. And you'd best be ready for some nasty business. Your dinner friends won't be very friendly once you confront them. In fact, I expect they'll transform into a terrible beast. Take this potion so they won't hang you out to dry. It will give you the most remarkable magical abilities. Now go to my writing desk and use the mystical ink well there. You need to prepare yourselves for a scrap. Now that I actually have time to talk for a second. So, if you guys haven't seen my community post, I got into a car crash. And... I'm physically completely fine. The other car that I collided with, they're perfectly fine. Everybody in the situation is physically fine, but I, I don't know about the person in the other car, but, but for me personally, my mental health has like taken a real big dive. So I need something to put my time into to, to distract me, I guess, as like a coping mechanism. And I love this game. I love this game so much, even though I'm kind of shit at it, but I still love it. So, that's what I'm doing now. I'm just gonna play some Cuphead. Hopefully, because I just recorded myself and I just played like an hour of Cuphead, like five minutes ago, I should I should still remember how to play it. How to play it. Prior to that recording I just did like five minutes ago, I have, I have not played this game in months. So, I'm probably still gonna suck even though I just played an hour of it. And the first thing that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to this shop and I'm gonna buy a new weapon because... The pea shooter is Garbaje, so I'm gonna get Roundabout, because that's my favorite shot in the game. Except for Crack Shot, but I, I don't have the DLC yet, so. Welcome! You got <laughs> you got to equip those new purchases if you want to use them. Look at your equip card, your bums. Now, I'm not the best voice actor, so I'm probably gonna sound garbage. The first thing I'm gonna do is this running gun level, because that's what I did first last time as well. And it'll, it'll help me uh, get back into this. Now, I might not have many things to commentate on because I've played this game before, but I'll try to commentate as much as I can. I'll try to actually, you know, be a Let's Player, but I can't promise that I'll say a lot because, you know, because I've played this game before and I'm not the best commentator. 
At least in my opinion. I don't think I'm that good at it. But I will try. Okay, and now I gotta figure out how to... There we go. And I'm gonna wait for the guy over there because I have a feeling I'm gonna dash right into him. But you see, that happened last time and I learned I learned my... I learned... I, I learned. What, what am I trying to say? I learned from my mistakes, so... Butterfly. Butterfly. And yes, I'm going to yell butterfly very profusely every time there's a butterfly butterfly on screen. And... I'm fine. Okay, you know what? First try. I did that first try. So, you know, I'm, I'm doing pretty good. That's not a good score, though. B, uh, it's okay. Now I'm gonna do the goopy fight. And then I'll do root pack, and I'll, I'll try to do the frogs. But when I recorded this last time, I was actually, like, the worst. I was just, like, so, so incredibly bad at that fight. I made the same mistake twice. I thought he was gonna bounce off the wall. Okay, Harry, Harry, Harry. And I still got hit. Oh boy. I did this first try last time, I believe, but I'm just not a god gamer, so I'm gonna have to do multiple tries of this, unfortunately. I just need to stay away from the corners, because it seems like that's, like... I hate you so much. I hope your, your family dies or something. What? Why is this hitbox so big? Uh, well, that that was a dumb question. Don't don't answer that. Got him. You know what? Third try. Third try isn't bad. I th I think it was more than three tries because I kept having to restart the level because I kept being a dumbass. Honestly, the frogs is, is probably what's going to take up the, the the majority of this video. Whenever I edit it down, the the frogs are going to take the longest because. I, I just can't deal with their third phase, especially the um the tigers, and also the devils. I I don't know. The snakes are like easy mode, but how? How did that happen? Okay, whatever. I literally hit the parry button. I, I said at the start of this video that I sucked at parrying, and you guys are seeing that like on full display. But yeah, I can't really deal with the the tiger or the 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 devils. Ugh hate you so much. I need to calm down. I, I think I'm just having, I'm just facing a lot of rage from the last, from the running gun level I did before I stopped recording uh, the last session. It was the, uh, the treetop trouble one or whatever, the one with the, the bugs and the, uh, the leafy boys. I was just like sucking so bad at that. Come on man, die. There we go. You know what? A minus ain't bad. Maybe at the end of this playthrough when I get through all the bosses. Cause, cause, okay, so fun fact. I actually have not completed this game. Like, the, like even on my own time, I have not completed this game ever. So, the, the, these, these two damn frogs are the bane of my existence. Not the first two phases. The, the first two phases are fine. I, I can get through them without taking a single hit of damage. But that, fr that third phase... Oh yeah, I also hate the fireflies. They're really annoying. Phase two. Yep, there we are. Okay. Doing pretty good so far. Oh my g I just did that in one rotation? Damn! I'm even better than I thought I was. I, I need to stop being so smug. Th this is how I'm gonna lose. I'm, I'm just gonna be smug. Oh crap, I forgot. I don't have my super art yet. I need to do the mausoleum. Y you know what? No, I have faith. I, I can do this without the super art. Yes! 
dude! Oh my god, I literally I literally said that this, this boss would take the longest. But I did that first try. I'm actually so good. I'm actually the best ever. And it's a B. That that's that's not good. But you, you know what? B can stand for best. Because I am the best. And I mean it's literally in my channel name, no best drummer. Okay, anyway, I have five coins. I just realized that. I need I need to get something. This immediately. I, I'm i I'm tired. I'm I'm you know what? The, this this smoke dash is literally gonna make my life so much easier. Especially for that running gun. I need to do the mausoleum too. Okay. Alright. Let's go do the mausoleum, then I'll do uh Blimp Lady. What's her name? Hildeberg. I'll do Hildeberg and then I'll do Cagney and then I'll try and do the rubble, the running gun level and then that'll be it for this video. Uh, sorry, sorry for the yawning. It's like what time is it? It's one in the morning. One one oh nine in the morning. I, I should be asleep, but I'm stupid, so I, I wanted I wanted to play video games. <laughs> the old, old man ghost. He's kinda funny. I think this is the last one, right? Victory! I skipped through the dialogue again. Last session I skipped through a dialogue. Where are my manners? I didn't even introduce myself. I am known as the legendary Talus. Pleased to meet you. I was searching for magic and got trapped by these ghosts. Speaking of magic, please accept this gift. It should help. There are other mausoleums in around Inkle Isle. I just wonder. You just wonder what? This super art is going to make my life so much easier. Dear me, you mustn't forget that magical super arts have to be equipped in the menu before use. Yes, I already know this. I've played this game before. This fight didn't give me too much trouble last time. It's just her last phase that kept, like, glitching out, like, when she transforms into the mechanical moon. She just, like, I don't know. Like, she just stays in her, like, weird freaking out phase. And she just stays there for a second before she like actually transforms. It, it's kind of weird. I need to get more parries, but I'm not being given any parry opportunities, so I can't do anything. I keep accidentally destroying the blimps. I mean, that, that's probably why I'm not getting any parries. You know what? It, it's, 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 it's fine. No, don't you, don't you... F I thought, I thought the, the, the gun wheel was gonna like spawn right on top of me and I would just take damage immediately. That would have sucked. Yes, parry opportunities. Yeah, like, yeah, like she just like glitches and she just stays with like her hands on her head, like she just has like the worst migraine of all time. It's very weird, but it's fine. I could have parried that, but it didn't work, so that's not cool. And got her. That did not take as long as last time. That means I'm actually getting better. Wow. That's an A minus, right? Yep. There we go. I got a golden flag for that one. So that's pretty cool. <sighs> Fine, I'll do the stupid fucking running gun level. I hate this level. I mean, I don't really like the running gun levels altogether, but this one especially just pisses me off. Like. The, the pier one and, like, the mountain one, they don't even come close to how annoying this one is. Nothing can come close to how annoying this level is. I remember the... I remember that the boss battle for this part, it glitched out last time, and, like, it just didn't let me complete the level after I beat the boss, so I, I, I don't know what was going on with it, but it was very strange. And now this part... This part is very annoying. This part is, like, so infuri infuri infuriating to do. I, I, I'm, I'm just so bad at parkour. Okay. Need to remember to go back for the coin. Okay. Alright. Now come back. And I'm gonna take my time. I'm just gonna wait until it's right. Alright, and now we have the boss battle. Oh, what do I do? Please, I need I need more platforms. There we go. 
Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Please just die. Please, please just die. Okay. Thank God. Thank God. What? Dude. You see, you see what I mean? Like, it glitched out there, and I, I jumped and dashed forward, but it just kept me at the other side of the wall. I'm, I'm lucky I had two health left there. Last time, I didn't even do this level. I, I couldn't even complete it because I just got too mad. Okay, Cagney. Now, the last time I did this in the last session, he didn't even do the seed attack, which I was greatly surprised by. I expected him to do the seed attack, but he, did, he just didn't do it. So, yeah, I, I don't know. He's actually doing it this time. Wow. Uh, where's the parry boy? How? Man. I hate that so much. That fucking... Oh! Okay. Alright, let's try that again. Try that again. Where's the parry boy seed? I pressed the parry button. Why did it not parry? That's so weird. I hate that it punishes you for not being able to parry because trying to parry something like e even just jumping down onto the seed as it's falling down or like trying to parry it from upwards is so awkward or trying to parry it while you're down below and trying to jump up and then parry it like trying to parry it as it's going down is so weird I, I just don't know how to do it There we go. Alright. That's a B minus, right? B plus, not bad. Let's go. Holy shit, I have seven coins. I'm the richest motherfucker ever. And I just got another coin. I have eight coins. I'm like the Elon Musk of like the Cuphead world. That was such a stupid joke. Okay, let's talk to uh, King Dice here. Who ain't that a pip? Looks like you boys really put the kibosh on them deadlifts. You can head over. You can head on over to the next aisle. Plenty more marks for you to lean on there. Guys, hang on. I think the stars are caught up with you. I believe I found a way to get out of this mess you're in. Hot dog, you have? Your strength is growing. You'll soon be a match for that no good King Dice, and maybe even the devil himself. Golly, do you really think? I do, but you'll never get close to the devil unless you already have those soul contracts in hand. Only then will you get the chance to turn the, the tables on that fiend, so when the time comes, do the right thing. I'm debating on whether or not to start this, because I actually completed Inkwell Isle 1 much faster than I did last time, so I think this is only like a 30 minute recording right now, so... You know what, I'll, I'll try Beppy. Eh. Eh, cupcake lady is easier. You know, I'll try I'll try Baroness von Bonbon, and if I can't do it like in a few tries, then I'll just end the video here. But oh god no. It's fucking awful. Oh no, I'm fine. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Uh, next one. Alright, EDP. How I managed to avoid any damage there is beyond me. Okay, I, I hate this one so much. But you know what? You know what makes this so much easier? I have Smoke Dash. And Smoke Dash is OP, so... What? Bro! Really? Okay, whatever. I can't remember if you can parry your head or not. I can test that right now, actually. Never mind, I, I don't want to test it anymore. I, I'm on 1 HP. Come on, just die. Just die, please. Please just die. Please just die. Just die! Ugh. How am I alive? How, how the hell am I alive? What the fuck is going on? Oh my god, I did it! Dude! I just dodged like 70 projectiles. I don't know how I did that. I, 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 I don't know how I did that. You know what, I think I'll do one more boss. And... I do like Jimmy better than Beppy, like in, in terms of their fights, like, like not how difficult they are, but I just like Jimmy more, so I'm going to do him, and then that'll be it for this episode. Oh, why, 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 why this one, why this one, 
This one sucks. I hate this one. Just die, man. Just die. There you go. I'm probably gonna die. I am most likely going to die now. Because... Because this phase is actually really hard. But hopefully I don't die. But I'm, prob but I'm probably gonna die. Got him. Okay, now this, this this phase is gonna be hard. Now, boom. Where am I? Where am I? Okay, there I am. What? I, I thought I had more time than that. I was actually very close. If I if I if I get like the cats or the swords for this first phase, I won't take any damage and I'll be fine. Dude. Man, that's so annoying. That that is so annoying. I have to be honest, I hate- I- I can't switch weapons, I forgot to talk to the guy. Third phase, in the exact same- literally in the exact same state as before, so... This is gonna suck. Boom. Just call me Oppenheimer, man. The way I be dropping these bombs. I can't say that, can I? What? Dude. I was literally so close. Again, yes, the swords. Thank God, it's the swords. The swords. These swords are my salvation, man. And they give me easy parry opportunities, so that's cool too. This would go a lot better though if I had the lobber bombs, but I don't. So, boohoo, boohoo me. I can't do anything. Now I don't know why, but this phase gives me so much trouble. So I probably should use my bombs on this phase instead. But I'm not smart, so I'm not gonna do that. Just die. Just die, please. Die, please. There we go. <sighs> okay. Alright. Alright. All right. Bomb time. Oh, damn it. Please. Please, man. Okay, there we go. Alright. Thank God that's over. Okay. Right. Get away. I, I gotta get the fuck away. And I got him, yeah! Okay, alright, alright. I almost got an A+. That's pretty good. If only I didn't take that stupid hit. On that note, I'm gonna make sure I actually have the, the, the lobber bombs this time. There we go, thank you. Thank you. I finally, okay, on that note, before I end this episode, we're gonna do what's called an in the end of episode status check or project progress check or whatever. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go through what shots I have. So I have the roundabout and I have the pea shooter. What super arts I have, I only have super art one. And to be honest, I don't know if I'm gonna do the other mausoleums because I like this super art the most. The inv the invincibility is pretty good, but. I'm not sure, and, and the giant ghost just sucks like dog water, so I'm not doing that one. And then we have the smoke dash charm, and let's go ahead, and so I got an A- minus on root pack, B- minus on groupie, I got an A- minus on Hildeberg, I got a B- plus on Cagney, and I got a B on the frogs, and B on the, B and a B- minus respectively for the two running gun levels, and then Baroness from Bonbon, I got an A, or no, I got a B, for Jimmy the Great I got an A. And the last thing we're gonna do is check how many deaths I have. Four times? Dude, last time it was 18. Man. I kinda wanna do a no death run at this game, but I feel like that's gonna be so that's gonna be so fucking hard. That's gonna be it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed, and have a good day.